I'm Dr. Mark Opperman from Dr. Mark Aesthetics and one of Gal Derma's local mentor trainers. And today and for the next couple of days, we are at the GAIN South Africa event. So GAIN is the Gal Derma Aesthetic Injector Network event. The event is focused on training of doctors. In South Africa, Galderma has 20 trainers. And for the rest of the day, we will be learning from an international expert on the use of Sculptra for use on body, contouring, lifting, and treatment of skin conditions. Before the morning's proceeding started, I caught up with Ilse Grunewald, the National Sales Manager for Galderma Aesthetic South Africa, to talk about their biostimulator Sculptra in the South African and international context. So we at the Galderma Aesthetic Injector Network event um, hosted here in Johannesburg and I'm joined by Ilse Grunewald, the National Sales Manager for Galderma Aesthetics. Ilse, welcome. Thanks, Mark. So, Tell us a little bit about Sculptra. It, it came on the market last year in March and it's taken the aesthetic world by storm. Give us a little bit of the insights that you guys have had from the company. Mark, when we introduced Sculptra into the market last year, we didn't realize how it's going to take off. Uh, we knew that it was a very, very well researched and good product and we were excited about introducing it into the market in South Africa. Um, but never in our wildest dreams did we expect the, the results and the sales and everything that we saw. It's important to know is that this product has been on the market internationally in various guises for more than 17 years. And if um, I'm correct, there's more than 44 countries in the world where it's registered for aesthetic use. But it is a product that's been uh, available worldwide for a very long time and I think that is important to know for South Africans to not feel that it's a, a, a brand new product introduced into the South African market without any research and scientific evidence and backing and um, that's not the case we've got a wealth of information scientific ed of evidence that it's a, a, a really really good product to use for skin laxity treatments. Okay so I think one of the biggest uh, pitfalls that we have in aesthetics today is um, the use of social media, where we sometimes get false imaging um, and uh, false information. But from your side, something that the public can be looking out for? It's important for the patient to be educated and for the patient to, to know what kind of a result um, they'll be getting so that they don't go into a consultation with the doctor with, with misconceptions on the result. Um, of the treatment. So we will make sure that, that the patient education side is there for the doctors to be able to share. After a spot of breakfast and a chance to catch up with friends and colleagues, I persuaded one of my dear friends, Dr. Michelle Emmett, to chat to me about her experience with a Galdoma range of fillers and biostimulator Sculptra. I'm joined by one of my favorite and esteemed colleagues, uh, Dr. Michelle Emmett from uh, Hermanus, as well as practicing in Harley Street, London. Michelle, welcome. How are you? Thank you, Mark. All good. Thank you. Okay. So, Michelle, um, you have been in the aesthetic industry for 15 years. Between the two of us, you know what, um, we've been practicing as long as we are old. So, we've seen everything. We've started with the neuromodulators, Botox, Dysport, blah, blah, blah. We've used all the fillers on the market and along came the biostimulator, Sculptra specifically. So I'm so excited about this product. Do you want to tell us a little bit more about your experience? Mark, absolutely. So in my practice, I've always done a lot of thread lifting, which as we both know, was very exciting and revolutionary about eight years ago. But the field of aesthetic medicine uh, progresses so rapidly mm. and if you want to keep up you now need to look at liquid threads. So essentially that's what Sculptra is. It's threads in a liquid form which is easily spreadable so for your patients there's no downtime, there's no bruising, um, it's a very minimally invasive procedure and the results are just next level. Mm. 
collagen is responsible for keeping everything in position. It's um, as it declines, we start seeing a lack of volume, elasticity, we're starting to see sagging and the luminosity of the skin. We spoke about a little bit of anti-aging and for me, and I, I think you agree, this is the perfect biohacking of the aging process of your face. We all know that as we aging, things start sagging and lagging. And really what sculpture does for us is it recreates the good collagen, the strong collagen, the youthful collagen. This is a perfect product for the patient who says to me, they don't necessarily want people to say, oh my goodness, what has she done? They want that soft, subtle, but continuing lifting, tightening effect. So your end result is the same, but nobody's going to say, oh my goodness, what has Madonna done to her face? So that's, that's where I really, really like this product. Who can use it? Anyone who shows me this that, yeah. and that when they're describing that the face facelift. or when they're describing the butter. Um, one of the things that we are here to learn today as the Galderma trainers from the international experts who are the Brazilians is the use of sculptural or body uh, biostimulators for body contouring and specifically for butts. So give us your thoughts on this. This is a very exciting wow, time for us. It is, it is a phenomenal time for us and I think we're very fortunate in South Africa. We parallel Brazil in that we have a multicultural diverse population group and this is good for all ages, all races, it, it's really a phenomenal product. So whether you have sagging, and I'm talking about in the buttocks area, in the breast area, in the upper Arms, arm area, even you, knees, even knees, if you have sagging skin, this is the product for you. So for me as an aging woman, Trust me, there are a lot of areas that I'm excited to use this product on with my patients, but I might just come to you for a little bit of lifting and tightening <laughs> myself. So what I want you to understand is your sculpture is a journey. It's not a single treatment. It's a course of treatments over time. Collagen forms from uh, 28 days yes. onwards, but it's ongoing Absolutely. and therefore it's not an instant result. This is something that we need to understand. Not on the face, not on the body. It's one, two, three, four treatments over time, but the results, natural, long-lasting and sustainable. Biostimulator is for mot de jour, and I asked medical advisor to Calderma South Africa Aesthetics, Dr. Vivian Jandera, to tell us what a biostimulator actually does. So biostimulate is a molecule or a chemical that causes your own body to set off a process that grows, in this case, grows your own collagen. And what those molecules do is they pull cells into the area where you've injected them, which cause a certain type of cell called a fibroblast, which is a cell that produces collagen, and it actually grows your own collagen, which gives you those fantastic effects that biostimulators form, like lifting, improving the quality of your skin and firming. So with aesthetic treatments, whether they're surgical, non-surgical, there's always a, a degree of complications and safety for us is paramount. Now, this is a safe treatment. It's non-invasive. Tell us a little bit more about that. I think it's a relatively safe treatment, but this is why Galderma is so obsessed with training doctors properly. We want everybody to know the internationally proven protocols. The people that we are learning for have 10 to 15 years experience and they're the ones that have worked out the global protocols on how to do these treatments and that makes them safer and this guarantees your results. So we're really keen on training South African doctors in how to do this procedure correctly. Part of which I think a great part of it is doing a correct assessment and then injecting at that correct level also managing patient expectations that because you're growing your own collagen, you're going to see your best results not before three months and probably in the body closer to six months.
I was really looking forward to an interview with the man himself, Dr. Marcus Marais, our international guest from Brazil, a renowned dermatologist and authority on Sculptra Boni, on this revolutionary biostimulator that is being used to treat buttocks and skin quality with great success. Dr. Marcus, the Brazilians are at the forefront and has been at the forefront of uh, aesthetic treatments for a very long time, specifically the biostimulators. It's originated basically in Brazil. Do you want to give us an overview of what this is and how it's taking the world by storm? Um, yes, we are a tropical country, country you know, so uh, most of women uh, use uh, some bikinis and uh, beach wears and, and, and we we have doing a sculpture in body uh, almost for uh, 10 years and the reasons is because I can reach some important uh, results uh, as uh, some um, improvement of the firmness, the flaccidity and give some contour and some lifting specifically treated uh, the cellulites. The cellulites uh, in Brazil is the main complaint um, including the women and some men as well. So this is a treatment not suitable to everyone for the simple reason uh, you have sometimes too much heaviness, etc., etc. Where would you start assessing the patient and who's the ideal patient? The ideal patient, in, 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 a, in a general way, <laughs> it's uh, thin patients, uh, young patients, health patients with no um, uh, immunologic disease because uh, the sculpture induces the production of collagen. So we should be healthy. So uh, young patient uh, from 20 until 60, 65 at maximum years old. For me, one of the takeaway messages um, on a biostimulator is this, this is not an instant result. And in your training that you gave us a little bit earlier, you said with Sculptra and biostimulators, time is your friend. Yes. How long do they need to wait for results? Minimum three months. And I think that the end point, the final end point, it be at least six, to one, six months to one year. So it's not immediate result as fillers or as toxin, uh, but we, we have to wait a minimum for three months because it's consequence of, produ of the production of new collagen. You know, so it's, it, it, it takes time. Longevity. How long would that result last? Um, this is not a cheap treatment to do. So I want to get the best bang for my buck. And if I have to weigh it up against having a surgical procedure versus having a non-invasive procedure with Sculpture, how long can I expect the results to last? Yes. The papers uh, published has shown that have, have shown that at least 24 to 25 months. Last question. Cellulite. It's something that I think 90% of women yes. will have to deal with at some point in their lives. Yes. Biostimulator, sculpture specifically for this in someone who is maybe not the ideal patient for lifting and contouring but wants to improve skin quality. Is this an ideal treatment for them? Yes, I think uh, um, cellulite, it's, uh, you, you know that cellulite uh, has multiple causes, you know, and uh, you have to treat all of them, uh, exercise, uh, loss weight, and, uh, but I think Sculptra is in, in a kind of an ed additional treatment to cellulite because improve skin quality. I think Sculptra um, focus on skin quality and cellulite is included in skin quality. I think it's, it's a great, great, great treatment. After lunch, it was hands-on time under the expert eye of Dr. Marcus. Our models were ready. We as trainers were ready. It was quite intense. And afterwards, we all came away with a renewed sense of vigor, expertise that was shared with us, 
and a sense of where we're going to put this product in our own practices. The event ran over two days, day one being the Train the Trainer event with 21 local mentor trainers from South Africa and the main event, the Gain Aesthetic Injected Network event where more than 240 doctors from all over South Africa came to learn more about the use of the Galderma Aesthetic portfolio including Restlin as well as Sculptra and the combined use thereof. For me, the morning was also a time to catch up with a friend and colleague, Dr. Alfreda Ferri, who managed to elude me on day one. I'm joined here by a very good friend and colleague of mine, Dr. Alfreda Ferri, aesthetic practitioner here in Parkmore, Johannesburg. So we are at the GAIN Injectors um, Network training today, and you're presenting on lips and the journey of lips through aging. Do you want to give us a little bit of a, a background about what you're going to talk about today? Yes, I'm going to give some insight into my experience treating lips and how to keep lips looking beautiful over time. Let's, let's think about this. In our 20s, lips is all about just creating a little bit of beautification. And as we get older, things start going south. Do you want to highlight some of those changes? That's very true. And just as a result of that, we need to think very carefully what we do in our 20s and 30s when we treat patients' lips, because that lip needs to stay beautiful forever. So over-treating of lips while we are young leads to problems that you and I have to address then in the patient's 40s and 50s and that becomes a real yes. issue. Exactly and not only in their 40s and 50s but sometimes a few years down the line in their 20s if lips have been over treated and not managed well. We always have to manage expectations and give the patients beautiful lips but beautiful lips for them not necessarily the pictures they see on Instagram. I, I'm so glad that you say that because so often I have patients coming into my office and they're gorgeous, um, but there's an imbalance in the face, specifically um, a tiny or a short lower third, and then they want bigger lips. And I always tell them, you know, we have to be careful because you mm -hmm. might look like Mrs. Potato Head. So when <laughs> exactly. we treat the lip area, it's actually treating the bottom half of the face. Am I correct? Yes, exactly. The lips are not the only feature in the face, even though we love to look at them. It's framed by so many other features and that will determine what we can do with the lips and what we should also not do. So we came to the end of the Galderma Aesthetic Injector Network event 2023. As one of Galderma's local mentor trainers, one of the key takeaways for me was how very comprehensive the Galderma Aesthetic portfolio actually is. We have a product to suit every indication and every patient, from tissue fillers to biostimulators. Galderma Aesthetic South Africa and its trainer network has a passion for educating fellow doctors and colleagues on the safe use of the products in the Galderma portfolio. Combining these can give all of us a new lease on life, looking as young as we feel treating all the signs of aging, whether it's volume loss, luminosity of the skin, skin quality, sagging, and now even body treatments, like contouring, lifting, projecting, and treating cellulite in the buttock area. For me, this was a wonderful event, and this, the principles that we learned here today and that we shared with other doctors will be the ones that I implement in my own practice.